Welcome to Dynamics Ignite from Technology Management. In this video, we will see how Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2013 makes it easy for you to create sales invoices, and you can either print them to send them to your customers, or you can save time and money by emailing them. I am logged on to Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2013 as a sales order processor. In this first example, I'm going to open a sales order that has been shipped but not invoiced. I go to my filtered view and find my order for technology management. This order has been shipped but not invoiced. I can now post and print and select invoice. If the customer is set to receive paper invoices, then it will be printed to the printer. If not, the customer contact will be sent at the invoice by email. I can now see the posted sales invoice either from the customer's record or by going to the posted documents. From my ribbon, I can also create a sales invoice without creating a sales order first. In this example, I'm going to create a sales invoice for the Canon Group. I have quick entry set up, so when I hit enter, it takes me straight to the external document number. I enter the customer's purchase order number, and then I can select the type of GL account as opposed to item this time. And I select a GL account, which allows direct posting. I can change the description, because this is what will appear on the invoice, and then put in a quantity of one, and a price of 500. Again, I can post and print and either send a paper copy or send by email. You can also create a sales invoice if you want to create a consolidated sales invoice for multiple shipments. I have created a sales invoice for the Canon Group, but this time I'm going to use the Get Shipment Lines function. This shows me all of the sales orders for the Canon Group that have been shipped but not invoiced. I select the orders that I wish to include in the invoice, they will be included into my invoice. I can then post and print as before and either create a paper copy or email. Sales invoices can also be created from a journal. Here I've created a line for the Canon Group and I can either post and print or email as before. Credit memos can be created the same as sales invoices. I enter the customer's details. I can then it's the posted document lines to reverse. This will show me all of the documents that have been posted. I can then select the relevant item and I can include it in my credit memo. I can then post and print as before and it will either be printed or sent by email. Chasing payment for sales invoice can be simplified by providing the credit controller with the information they need. For example, from this role centre, I can see that I have 13 sales invoices that are overdue and need chasing and here is the information. In summary, we have seen our Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2013 makes it quick and easy for you to create sales invoices and consolidated sales invoices. You can also save time and money by emailing invoices rather than printing. 